While the defamation trial between Amber Heard and Johnny Depp was ongoing, there were several instances where talks on family came up and that brought up a lot of questions about Amber's family members not partaking. Well, the cat is finally out of the bag and if you thought Amber was a terrible person before, you might need to buckle up for what you're about to find out. So, exactly what is the news on Amber Heard's family? During the trial, Amber's family was repeatedly brought up, mainly because her sister had lived with her while she was married to Depp and was called by her team to speak as a witness. But it seems she wasn't actually the first family member that was called up to get involved in the case as a witness, as news just revealed that the actress's father was actually the first option. This is probably shocking to anyone one that watched the trial because Amber's dad's name never actually came up when they were in court. But one of the reporters who has been involved in this whole thing right from the start has revealed that her dad actually declined to be one of her witnesses. The revelation was made via a tweet by Laura Bakov, saying her own father didn't volunteer to testify for her. If he had, those texts post TRO showering love for Johnny and how the lawyers made her lie for the TRO so she could stay in the penthouse would be admitted. This was a huge deal and a lot of people couldn't even fathom the idea that a father would turn down such a huge deal when his daughter was being accused of domestic violence. Well, it basically just confirms all of our suspicion about Amber from the start. Because her father refusing to be a party to the case implies that he probably knows it's something she's either capable of or something she was actually doing during their marriage. And if we were to go by the evidence that was presented in court, the latter seems to be more like the truth. And to put icing on the cake, Amber herself actually confirmed that her ex-husband and her dad were pretty close. In fact, during the second day of this whole trial, the actress testified to that fact. According to her testimony, Depp and her father were together almost throughout her engagement party and after that, they still maintained their relationship. Now, thinking about things from a basic family point of view, the chances of a man getting close to someone that was consistently assaulting his daughter is probably less than likely. This is why a lot of people resonated with the reports on Amber's dad not wanting anything to do with the trial. But this was unlike the case of her sister Whitney who actually took the stand to testify against Johnny. According to Amber's sister, Johnny attacked them on the staircase of their house shortly after the actor had lost his finger and had a cast on. Now, when Whitney made these statements on the stand, a lot of people questioned her sincerity because if we're being honest, it seems less than likely that someone who just lost a finger would be attacking anyone with that same hand. Well, after a lot of arguments back and forth, it was finally revealed that Amber had actually also been assaulting Whitney Wright from when they were young, and that, according to people on the internet, was the main reason that she had to stand with her sister. All of this was quite a lot for people on the internet, and a lot of people had one thing or the other to say about it, starting with this user who wrote, Amber Heard has been proven a liar via her claims of DV by Johnny Depp. In court, Depp described many incidents of DV that he suffered at the hands of Heard, including punching him, slapping his ears and when she shattered his finger. He will bear that scar for the rest of his life. Another user who was more concerned about the specific incident Whitney testified about wrote, We don't talk enough about the discrepancies in the story of Whitney Heard and Amber Heard about the staircase incident. The only instance with a witness. Someone else also added, Amber Heard proved herself to be a liar when she said under oath I never assaulted Johnny then proceeded to describe every time she assaulted him. She also turned herself into a criminal by committing a class 5 felony. It is one thing for her to repeatedly lie and make a fool of the legal system. But it is another completely different thing for her to drag her family into all of this. And her stooping low enough to risk her sister's neck, coupled with the fact that her father refused to get involved just goes to tell you how horrible of a person she is. Tell us, how do you think Amber plans to spin this one?